So if you are a Muslim, how can you make sure you do not invalidate, dismiss, or minimize another Muslim's feelings and thoughts about an experience that he or she experienced? So what is psychological invalidation? Well, psychological invalidation is when someone's feelings and thoughts about an experience that he or she experienced is dismissed, is minimized, is invalidated by someone else or by a group of people. And it's usually in regards to a negative experience. And in an Islamic community, this can and does exist. So if you are a Muslim, how can you make sure you do not invalidate, dismiss, or minimize another Muslim's feelings and thoughts about an experience that he or she experienced. Well, in short, and this is just the base, there's a lot to it, but one, know that you do not have to agree with the Muslim's feelings and thoughts about his or her experience. Two, listen. Listen with active listening, meaning when that Muslim is talking to you, you are reflecting back to that Muslim what he or she is saying. That allows the Muslim to know that they are heard, understood, and their feelings and thoughts matter. And three, and probably the most difficult is do not give advice. 